students at Westminster College are marking Martin Luther King Jr. Day with a rally and a march through Sugar House. Fox 13's Big Buddha was there for the celebration. If you're awake now, which some of you are probably awake because they're, they're taking today as a holiday, and rightly so, in uh, memory and honor of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., you might be thinking to yourself, wait, wait a minute, what, what can I do? This, this is a lot bigger than, than what I, it's not, it's more than just having a day off. There's some other things that are, that are at stake here. How can I participate? How can I help out? So, so tell me, how are you guys getting organized? Well, you, you've really had a big part in organizing some of the efforts here as far as celebrating and honoring Dr. King. Isn't that right? Yes. Yes. What, what have you got going on? Well, we're so excited about what's happening at Westminster this week around the Martin Luther King Day, and we're extending our, our activities throughout the week. We have a rally this morning, and then we have a lecture later this morning uh, feature with featuring events and featuring uh, students and remarks. And then later on this week, we have a day of service as well. Now, are any of these activities open to the public where if they feel like, I don't feel like I'm doing enough. I don't think I'm, I don't feel like I'm doing anything at all to honor Dr. King's memory. Are, are they allowed to come and participate? Absolutely. And not only is it part of honoring his memory, but it's also saying, what are, reminding ourselves about his messages, reminding ourselves about his practices and how he sought to achieve civil rights for all. And even though that was 50 some odd years ago when uh, his work in the civil rights movement occurred, those things are still needed today. And so we can all join together to remind ourselves and figure out ways to improve our quality of life. Is Dr. King's message still pertinent for us in today's times? Are we altering it, or is it the same message that he delivered? It's the same message, and we need to go back to his speeches, back to his readings, back to his writings, to really get us, remind ourselves what he really meant, what he really said, and then apply those things most accurately to get the best results we want, which is a great quality of life for all of us that we can share and enjoy this world together. Tamara, thank you so much. Thank you. Great thoughts. Uh, for a list of the activities on what's happening at Westminster that you can participate in, we'll make it easy for you by putting a link on our website. All you have to do is go to fox13now.com.